Hello guys, Xbox Fusion here, and I just wanted to uh, do a, a small review on on Cinema 4D or 13 uh, rendering, ambient occlusion, and global illumination. So yeah, I'm gonna do this on uh, the high settings, maybe medium settings, and I'm gonna compare the medium settings with R12. Uh, medium settings, so yeah, let's see how long it's gonna take me to just render this small thing. It's gonna take a while, maybe. <clears throat> oh, I just only have a three core computer, and I know for graphic designing and using Cinema 4D, you need a really awesome computer with a eight core computer or 6 core it will be awesome so see how fast it rendered it was really fast I liked it so now this was Cinema uh, R12 now let's see R13 let's move the text it looks stupid it's okay render these <coughs> Mm hmm it takes the same time I think and it looks the same so yeah it looks the same and it takes the same time to just render I think that's a small review for me but I'm gonna test it uh, with the high settings high details and heavy it's gonna take a while this is our 13 okay let's see I'm gonna shut up okay so that was fast I thought it was gonna take longer than that but no it was fast it was really good now let's see R12 in a high settings. Uh, let's put really, really heavy. Okay, now let's render. I think it will take the same time, so yeah. Well, I think this took. Uh, uh, this was faster than the other one. But I don't know, guys. So I think I like Cinema R12 uh, 13 better. I don't know. It looks very nice. I like it. But I'm used to R12 really nice looking thing. I like it. So, yeah, that's it, guys. Thanks for watching. Uh, please rate the video and comment if you have any questions or you want to see me do anything any tutorials yeah and subscribe for more <laughs> peace